Good morning, guys. Welcome to our live workout where today we are doing strength training. My name is Jody Bulletin. This is our daily live workout. So join me every day here at 9.30 a.m. for a workout. And then Monday, Wednesdays and Fridays are going to be strength training. So we're going to do some body conditioning, which is going to change the shape of our body. To be honest with you, this is the most important workout of your life. So if you only do one workout, make sure it's the strength training workout. On Tuesday and Saturday, we're just going to be marching for half an hour. And on Thursdays and Sunday, we're going to have a little bit of a dance. Okay, so that's our exercise schedule. So today, we're strength training, but we're just going to do a warm up and we're just going to have a little march, guys. So it's going to be nice and easy. It is 9.30, so we're going to get going. We've got a little bit of background music. The music is not so important, especially when we're strength training. And for those of you who've done body pump before, it's going to be a little bit like that. However, instead of doing lots of repetitions, we're going for three sets of 10 exercises. So this is very much a beginner's workout. So if you haven't done anything for a while, this workout's for you. If you want to go into a little jog or you want to lift your knees up higher, then feel free. As long as you're warming up your body, that's the most important thing. The other good thing about our workouts, they're equipment free. You don't need anything. I would suggest getting yourself a drink. I'm drinking a fizz stick. This is a pomegranate fizz stick, which is an alternative to coffee and fizzy drinks. It's got a natural natural caffeine in. Lots of B vitamins as well in there. So if you don't live in the sunshine like me, <laughs> you need those B vitamins to make you feel good. So yeah, this is a warm up, just marching away. We've got another couple of minutes. Morning to Tina. Morning Tina. We're doing strength training this morning, but we're starting just marching. As always guys, if you've never done one of my workouts, I'm opening, I'm open for question and answers all the time. So feel free to ask. For those of you who've got fizz sticks, What's your favourite flavour? Pomegranate is the most popular. Oh, hi Sue. Morning. Are you joining us in the workout today? We're just warming up right now. Nice and easy. Right, we've got less than a minute to go. Because we've only got 30 minutes, we're going to do a full body workout. I've well, got three minutes on each body part. Right, so warm up finished. Just shake out. We're going to have a little stretch as well later on. So first of all, we're going to work the biggest body part, which is of course the quads and thighs. So we're going to do some squats. So take your legs wider than your hips, your toes slightly pointed out. And all I want you to do is to squat down and come back up. So nice and slow, take your time. We're going to do 10 of these and then have a little break. So as slow as you can. Three. Four. Go as low as you can, but keep your chest proud. Five. Six, seven, just two more to go guys. 
Last one. And give yourself a little shake, just releasing off. So we've done 10 repetitions and we're going to do three sets. So we're going to do that two more times. If you only do, want to do one set or two set, that's completely up to you. Right, let's go. Set two. Again, think nice and slowly. Think about where we're working. So when we lift back up, this is when we're using those quads, we're using all those leg muscles. Three. Four. Okay, saying hi. Are you squatting, Kay? I've lost count. <laughs> <laughs> Just keep going. I think it was five. The six. This is the bad thing about Facebook Live. Seven. This time I'm going to do it with a side view, just so you can see my straight back and how far my foot is going. Now you can actually go as low as you like. So remember 10. So one, two, three, four. Three more to go guys and we've done the thighs. Three, two, last one. And we'll do, have a little shake, grab yourself a quick drink. Okay, next up we're going to do press ups. Don't worry, I'm going to show you the easy option. The easiest option is to do wall press ups. So you just go against the wall. And all you would do is go down and lift up. So as simple as that. So that is a wall press up. That is good enough. If you want to use the floor, you can do a box press up, which looks like this. So your hands are underneath your shoulders, your knees are underneath your hips, and you literally just go down and up. If you want to make it harder, you can take your knees away. Or if you really want to go for it, you can do full press up, so it's completely up to you. I'm going to be doing box press ups, so let's go. So slowly down, elbows come wide, and lift back up. So make sure your shoulders are over your hands, or your chest is over your hands, and just make sure you can feel this through your chest because that's where we're working your chest and your shoulders. That's three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Two more. Have a little shake, have a little drink if you need one. Okay, so that was set one done. We're now moving on to set two. Right, against the wall or on the floor, let's go. Now, one, two,
one more time. And slowly release it again, just shake off. If you need to stretch, this is the stretch that you want to open out through those chest and feel the stretch through the shoulder. Okay, one more go. Against the wall, on the floor. Here we go. Okay, next we're going to work our back. Now this one is called Superman. Now you do need to lie down on this one. So if you've got a big sofa, you can lie on your sofa. If you're in your bedroom, lie in your bedroom. If not, you want to lie on the floor. Now Superman, we literally, in a straight position, and we just lift our arms and lift our legs and relax. As simple as that. So this is working through our back. Let's go. Two. Nice and gently. Three. Four. One. And relax. If you need to stretch your back, this is a nice stretch. Again, have another drink of water if you need one. Whew. So you're saying uh, needed morning motivation before I go off to work at the gym? Yes. This is what it's all about, doing something for you before you help some other people, so. Okay, let's do that again. I'll lie this way so you can see a different position. So, nice and straight. And lift. Estimated me how tough this one is. When I'm in the gym, working my back is my favourite thing. This is tough. I'll show you one more position over here. So again, legs straight, arms straight. Let's just do it. Come on. One. Two. Eight, 
three more. Nine. Last one. Oh, well done, guys. Obviously, you come unfinished. Definitely need a bit of fizz stick now. Okay, next, we're going to work triceps, which is the back of the arm, also known as bingo wings. Right, now for this one, you can either put your hands on a sofa or a table and do dips like this, or the easier version is to stand on the bed or a floor and then just go back. And lift, so nice and slowly. Uh, there is a version you can do standing if you need to, and that is where you use the wall and you're going to take your elbow down and lift back up. Okay, so that's working the triceps. I'm going to do the seated version here, but let's go. So, one, two. should be burning. You need a stretch. This is the stretch that you want. Change. Let's go again. Dip. One. Two. Well done, that's 10. Again, have a little shake, have a drink, whatever you need to do to keep going. Third and final set, let's go. so much. <laughs> One more for me. And relax. Oh, wow. Have a shake. Have a stretch. Have yourself a drink. Hold well on guys. Right. We've got a fun one now. Officially, this is biceps, which is here. But all I want you to do, imagine you've got some boxing gloves on. Imagine you're my friend Helen, who does boxing. And all we do is go round, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Ooh. Feels good. <laughs> so obviously, I don't know if you can feel it, but what we're doing is as you pull round, this is when we're using that bicep to pull in. We're also using our shoulders as well. But this is a nice, gentle bicep exercise. I've got lots of different exercises, but we're starting with the easiest, the basic, to get the best results, the easiest way possible. Who doesn't want that? Right, ready? On guard. So, one. Fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, 
19. 20. Whew. We're ready for you, Anthony Joshua. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always ready for Anthony Joshua. <laughs> right, let's go. Round three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Definitely my favourite exercise. Right, let's move on to your not favourite exercise, and this is lunges. And you've got two more exercises to do, you guys, and we're stretching. So what I want you to do is take a big step backwards, hold on to a wall if you need to, and all we do is down and lift. So go as low as you can. Three, four, five, six, seven, Nine, ten, change legs, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, change leg. one. We need a little break, don't we? My legs are killing right now. We're changing the shape of our thighs and our bottoms. This is why it's a, such an ache. Right, one more set. Let's get them done. One, two, More. Oh, guys, well done. That's the hardest bit done. We're going to stretch through those quads or through the hip flexor. Knee down, push the hips forwards, feel that stretch through the front of the thigh. Inside. Okay. Now, our last exercise is a plank. I know you're all crying right now. <laughs> this is the easiest version. Seated plank. Sit down, straighten your legs. It's hard because this is not hard. So yeah, you just want to straighten your legs. This is a want to do an original plank. You can come onto your knees, front your elbows, nice and straight, and just stay here. If you want to do a full plank on your toes, stay here. So it's up to you. But this is the exercise, is just to stay in this position for three minutes. I repeat, three minutes. <laughs> you need to have a break, have a break. Keep 
breathing. Right, we've got less than one minute to go. stretch. So let's stretch all those areas that we've worked. We're going to stretch through the quads. If you can't get your leg up in this position, take that knee down and push the hip forward to stretch through the hip flexor and the quad. Change sides. Now if you feel tired or achy in any of these areas, remember these stretches Next one, chest, open through that chest, have a lovely big stretch. We're also going to stretch through the shoulders. Don't know about you, but I'm warm. So tomorrow morning, we're going to be doing 5,000 steps. We're just going to be marching for half an hour with some classic cheesy tunes. <coughs> open through your back now. So just imagine you're giving me a big hug, pull the shoulder blades apart. Next we did triceps, so stretch those triceps, push, pull, or you can reach in the knee and feel that stretch. Change it sides, push, pull, or reach in the knee. Then we did biceps. So we need to stretch through those biceps. Change. Right next was our glutes, our bottom. Hold on to the wall. Get your leg across. And just bend the knee to build the stretch through the outer thigh on the bottom. I like to call this the flamingo. Change sides. And the last thing that we worked was the abdominals. All I want you to do for this one is reach up and back. Because we've got time, we'll do the IT band as well. So one leg behind and the same side up and over. Looks very glamorous, this stretch. Changing sides. So this was our body conditioning strength workout. Doing this with me three times a week will change the shape of your body. That's what I'm doing it for anyway. <laughs> if you want to join me, guys, it's a beginner's workout. I show you lots of options. And that's it. Your workout's done. Have yourself a drink. That was your workout complete. Uh, I'll see you again tomorrow with 5,000 steps live at 9.30. Thank you so much, guys. Uh, Thursday is dance day, as is Sunday. Uh, but I'll see you every day at 9.30. Glad you enjoyed that, Tina. See you soon. Bye for now, guys. Bye.